Hi guys, and I'm back. All right, so this is episode four of season two, or is it episode five? No, it's episode five of season two. So here we go. Oh, this don't look good. No going back. Our recording. All right. Like everything's going well. Viewers kick back off, but they should be back if anybody comes back. All right. Episode five. Hey, Milkus. How you doing? Part of survival. I only need a minute. Should have put you out of your misery right then. I look at Kenny now. He just he seems broken. Broken people get reckless. Here. Thanks. That's good, Milkus. That's good. Things start heading glad oh damn this again I'm glad he didn't miss it hit the kid I'm doing all right I had a headache for most of the day but it's stalled out due to a lot of Tylenol and a lot of silence earlier before streaming, so I'm, so I'm feeling better. This is probably the final season or final episode of the season, so that's good. I'm debating whether or not to keep with The Walking Dead or move on to a different game. Might go to Detroit Being Human or one of those games. I don't know if I could beat that in five days. Yeah, I'm glad I'm better too, Mocus. It was kind of annoying to get that headache. Oof. More like a migraine, actually. I probably could, yeah. It's just one of those games where it's, I, I feel like doing everything. I got pretty far last time I played it, but I didn't finish it. But I like to uh, take my time with games like that. But considering I only play like two hours a day. Oh, I gotta save the kid. Poor kid. Can't let him die. Clem's not that much of a monster. See him out there. Good work, Clem. Shit. Okay. Okay, we gotta do something, y'all. Get down here. Can't just sit here and let this guy take pot shots at us until he runs out of ammo. Stay down. You're gonna get your head blown off. We can't just sit here. This don't have to get any worse than it already is. You can just go. Oh yeah. A lot is happening. It'll give him something to think about. Just long enough for me to make it over. I'll try. Yeah. Okay. Good. Oh god, this is a bad idea. God, Luke. I wonder if I screwed up. I, I don't think I could have killed him. Shut up! 
<laughs> gotta do what you gotta do to survive. Leave him alone, Kenny. He's just a kid. No, I'm ending this. Get out here right fucking now. This is what you put up. Oh no. No. Oh man, this is getting crazy. Oh crap, Luke or er, Serv uh whatever his name is getting mad. What the hell? Who just got Oh Jane! That I did not expect. Just killed him like he was a walker. Severed his brain uh stem. Oh god. I'm surprised Kenny didn't get hit. Safe to come out. Here, I got him. Damn, that was crazy. Jesus Christ. That was, uh, that was intense. I thought, man, I thought that was it. Yeah, it was for these assholes. Thanks for coming back. I didn't know this man. I never killed someone that didn't wrong me in some way. That didn't deserve it. Tried to pretend he was a walker. But it's different. I didn't think it would be. He deserved it. He was trying to kill us. Yeah, that's why I did it. But I felt wrong. Oh, Kenny does know his stuff. Come on. Okay. How did this happen? She turned. Just like that. Don't you go blaming yourself, Kenny. You did what you had to, to protect the boy. She just lost too much blood. Ain't nobody's fault. Damn. You know, we could have done better by her. She was just too far gone. She's with Alvin now. Oh, yeah. that's a nice thing to say. Yeah, she is. Don't worry, Becca. We'll take care of your boy. You rest easy. Oh, God, here we go, Alvo, whatever your name is. Hey, hey! Oh, shh! Stop! Guys, get guys, off me! Come on! It's over, man. He ain't a threat to us. How can you say that? Of course he is. Get out of the way! Whoa! What are you doing? I'm doing the same thing this asshole tried to do to us! Oh, <laughs> he can actually encourage this? Kenny, please! Oh, I'm gonna do that. Kid, man. Move out of the way, Mike! You... Clint, you, you don't mean that. Is it his house? Food? Please. Please, I can take you. Bullshit! No, no! It's true. We have place not far for food. See, he wants to help. Oh, don't be stupid. He's just trying to save his skin. Why the hell would you help us? Huh? I, I now want to see more people dead. Then close your eyes and I'll make it quick. Kenny, back off. If he's telling the truth, it could save us. No, we can use the food. Us. We need the food. None of this will matter if we all starve to death. <laughs> right, We're running low on supplies as it is. I don't trust him either, Milkus. To check this place out. Trust him, don't trust him. It doesn't matter. But I need the we food. We should go anyway. We just need to be careful. It can't be far from here. You stay out of this. You're the reason these fuckers came after us in the first place. Don't try and pin this on me. Lay off, Kenny. She just helped us. Don't blame her for what these people did. Think about the baby, Kenny. If there are supplies, we need them. We ain't gonna last much longer without more food. We gotta take a chance. Unless someone's got a better plan. We got something to tie this shit bird up. Yeah, I got something. <laughs> Follow me, I thank you. Just give me a reason. Yeah, man, he gets it.
Oh, poor Luke. He's got some holes in his leg. Look, I know you're probably pissed about me leaving. When I heard the gunshots, I, I knew it was a mistake. If it helps, the thing I'd normally do is walk away for good. But I didn't. Despite what my instincts are telling me. Despite <laughs> everything I've seen. Everything I've been through. We needed you, but you left. How do I know it won't happen again? Believe it or not. I could have said you want a cookie. <laughs> make this work. Oh, I should have said that, but I don't want an aggravator. Promise you I won't abandon you again. Which, to be fair, I've never done before. Even though I probably should have. A few times now. You don't gotta point the gun at him the whole time. You forget what we just went through? He ain't going anywhere, Kenny. No need to get your arm all sore. <laughs> I'm worried about Kenny. He's... He's in a dark place. We gotta keep an eye on him. Everything he's been through. But he's lost. It's changing him. He'll be okay. I've known him a while. Well, it's all starting to pile up. It's weighing on him. Everyone has a breaking point. Yeah, I should have crisscrossed. I didn't want to come across as a complete the only one that he trusts. asshole, he so to speak. That means you're <laughs> the one that's going to have to pull him back. He's counting on you. If we're really going to make this work, we're all counting on you. <laughs> Cookies always make things better. I know. This Oh yeah, now I'm starting to get hungry. Come Oof. on, slow pokes. I'm glad no one actually died during that firefight. That would be a problem. I mean, you know, no one on our side. Ooh, come on, Wait Luke, up. don't die on me. Do I need to stop? No, no, I'm, I'm fine. Hey, I just need a second. Sorry, I just, I just put more weight on it than I should have. All right, wait there. Hey, what I say? When I tell you something, you fucking listen, you understand? Can it, come on, there's no need for that. He's getting what he deserves. Oh, boy. And he's snapping. I'm fucking talking to you. I say stop. You'd best stop. If yeah. you know what's good for you. He deserves it. He deserves to be I treated like a human being. I don't like that look he That's gave me. After what he did, what happened back there was his fault. He lost all his people in one fell swoop. Ain't much we could do to him that'd be worse than that. Kenny, please, ease up on him. Just fucking stay put. I'm gonna have a word with Kenny. He doesn't have to treat him that way. Kid's been through enough. You all right here? Yeah, yeah. Uh, go on and talk to him. I got Clem if I need anything. Okay. Here, just take the baby. Okay. And look at it, you can see the bullet hole in that leg. What do you mean? Every man I've known is always trying to let each other know how tough they are. <laughs> Put them in their place. Well, alpha dog tendency. Bunch of dominant alpha male horse shit. And it all ends the same way. Well, don't look at me. I ain't that guy. Oh, that ain't true. That's what I'm thinking, Milkus. You've your fair share of pissing matches, too. Do I? Are you kidding me? Yeah, I've noticed that, too. I don't know why it has to be that way. It just is. Get two of them in a room, and it's just a matter of time before they're challenging each other to something. Yeah. Yeah, I think he Suppose does need I'm medical in attention. Spitting contest to agree with you. Any more oxy or is it gone? Guess it took a woman to talk some sense into him. Looks like Jane broke it up. Keep pressure on it, okay? I'm gonna go fetch some bandages. I don't got any more medication, right? No, that's all gone from hey, last Bonnie. episode. Yeah. I'm sorry. For what? I'll be right back. Damn it. How are you feeling? If I'm being honest, I, I've been better. How did we get here? We walked. 
<laughs> you basically had to be carried. A little levity there. Sitting in the snow, laying up against a tree, bullet in my leg. I thought it went through. But alive. <laughs> and so many of my friends are dead for no good reason. And I couldn't do anything to stop it. Everyone we set out with just gone. Nick, Pete, Alvin, and Becky. Carlos, Sarah, and for what? They don't make any sense. They didn't die in vain. I wish I could believe that. I could have done more, and that ain't up for debate. I know it in my bones, and I gotta live with it. All right, this should work. That's perfect. What'd I miss? Hmm? Uh, nothing much. You know. Planning mostly, trying to guess how far this place is. <laughs> yeah. I'll help his uh, okay. his ego there. You tell me if you don't want to. I'm fine. Hey, Clem, go over and see if you can change the bandages on Kenny's wound. I offered, but I don't think he was comfortable with me doing it. But you know him better than I do. Okay, that a go. That's gonna sting, but only for a second. It's gonna clean it. Oh, I know what it does. It's gonna suck. This <laughs> <laughs> uh, orbital will smash, so I don't know what it's gonna look like. I was thinking we'd go with Alvin Jr. What do you think? Rebecca mentioned she'd like to name him Alvin if it was a boy. I mean, Rebecca was so out of it she hadn't settled on a name. Huh, yeah, I like it. Alvin Jr. it is. Do you like that? Well, I think AJ approves. Hey, AJ. What you uh, got there? Because I think I'm all right. I mentioned it earlier. I'm changing your bandage. Sounds like I don't have much choice in the matter. Oh, this is not going to look pretty, is it? Shouldn't have to do a lot of things. All right, let's get it over with. Hopefully, it don't scare this little guy or you. Okay, let's do it. Let's see what's underneath the bandage. What's underneath door number one? So how's it look? I still gonna be pretty when this heals. I'm glad Carver's dead. <laughs> Not that bad. I was like, expecting to see uh, a hole or something. What? How come it? Don't worry. It can't be that bad. Heck, it wouldn't let me. Oh, there we go. So, I'm guessing this is gonna be the shitty part. This <laughs> is gonna hurt like hell. <laughs> gonna hurt like hell. Well, you could have lied a little, you know. Ugh. Mm. Holy fucking hell. Get over it, Kenny. You need to stop squirming. Yeah. Yeah, okay. You're right. Oh, yeah. I thought that too, Milkus. It's... <sighs> oh, shit. Oh, yeah. You can hear a few bad words. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, it used to be an eye. Shouldn't have been the case. I should have gave myself up. Alvin didn't have to die like that. I'm gonna think about that every time I look at Alvin Jr. here. Alvin uh. should be here, raising this boy. It should be him. The best thing you can do for Alvin. And Rebecca, is raise him right. Make sure he's safe. I intend to.
Oh god, okay, that's over with. All done. Thank you, sweetie. Yep. Are we ready to go? Let's head out. Oof. Damn, I hate looking at people getting treated with medical, you know, bandages and stuff. Alright. What do we got from here on? I have a bad feeling that Arbo here is gonna, like, try something shifty. Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you! What? It? it? It's what? Arvo, that's not what you're taking us to, right? How much further is the house you were talking about? Answer her, goddammit! We still have more work. Some more hours. What? Damn it! I knew this was gonna happen. This guy fucked us. Ugh. Thank you. No mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking nowhere. Luke needs a break. We probably all do. Look, I'll do whatever you guys want, okay? But I could use the rest. It'd be safer to rest in there. Oh, There's boy. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. That sounds an ass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, shh. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some... Oh, boy. Here we go. I'll go with you. Uh, see if... Uh, see if you can calm it down a bit. Oh, stop. Getting fussy. No, that's all you. <laughs> hey, maybe I can make it laugh. Wouldn't have guessed that it worked. <laughs> Me neither. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. That's a good sign. He's cute. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's true. They usually look like weird little aliens. <laughs> Here, I got him. Come on over. Weird little aliens. Today's my birthday. Near as I can tell, at least. Definitely this week. Happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. Thanks. So, that makes you... What? 27? That's... that's right. I'm surprised you remember. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like Thanks, Milkus. Hope you have a great night. At least I don't Take care now. About paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork waiting to collect. Bye bye. Probably. I'd have liked to go to college. What did you study? Majored in art history. That's cool. Nighty night. <laughs> Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. You get a minor in agriculture. Keep the old man happy. I know his oh, voice actor. I, I can't place it. Was saving it for a special occasion, and all it being your birthday and all, figure this is as good a time as any. I'd like a sip. <laughs> I'd like a sip. I mean, after you, obviously. Really? No. Oh, what's a sip gonna hurt? You are not drinking. That is that. Feel a little guilty taking the first. Whoa! Thing. Wait. You gotta make a toast. <laughs> I'm not really the uh Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. 
A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> oh, it's rum. I thought that was wine or something. To the loved ones that we've lost along the way. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well, I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. Come on, Kenny. At least have a drink. Nah, maybe later. Oh, he's not drinking. Usually the first one to do it. I'm gonna post up maybe he's sober now. Thanks, Kenny. Fire's real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. Well, no, that's a good thing she was there. I just don't know what she's getting at all this. We're lucky to have her. I'm glad she's here. Well, she helped us back there. So that puts her as okay in my book. Well, it ain't no secret how you feel about her. <laughs> oh, come on. I'm just teasing. And was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. <laughs> all right. Ten minutes. Come on. You got a little Oh, one. shit. Little one. Sorry. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about... Kissing stuff. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes. That that is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now. For both of you. <laughs> kissing. A lot worse than that. Maybe she came back for you. Could be. I'd come back for you. <laughs> I'd come back for you. You know what I mean. Thank you, Clint. Do the same. Luke's a regular the bond. Hey, the bonding experience here. Your moves are working on all the way. Worked on me. Ooh. Oh, shit. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry. It's the drink talking. They say a drunk man's talk is a sober man's thought. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this will change the moods. Alright, talk to the ice queen over here. Hey, what's... At least we don't need to worry about being electrocuted. <laughs> Talk to Jane for it. Oh. I don't want to be a complete asshole. But let's take a look at, let's see what Arvo. I'm, I'm sorry about your sister. Didn't spit me my face or anything. That's a good sign. Yes. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol. <laughs> I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. Will it work? That depends. What is it? It's rum. Probably. Ooh, is she is she like Luke? I don't know. It, it might be awkward. I 
wasn't expecting to. Because you made it with Luke? You know. It doesn't <laughs> have to be. We're all adults here, are we now? <laughs> you know what I mean. Mature or whatever. I wish it was that easy. It is. People just love making it harder than it has to be. Why does this feel like I'm signing a contract or something? That's really good. Have you had any? You wanna sit? It's okay. Um, sure. Time to get drunk! <laughs> okay. Oh, Kenny didn't like that. Uh-oh. Busted. I better take that back. I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh, what was its name? I was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. I guess I was. There's a ragamuffin. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar <sighs> crystals. And I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' <coughs> dining room floor to get at them. <coughs> and it shattered into a thousand pieces all over the dining room. Sounds like a mess. Yeah, it was. <coughs> Every couple years, Oof. someone would step on a piece of glass that didn't get swept up and get mad at me all over again. Oh, the problem with glasses, it looks a lot like sugar crystals. Oh, that's how she ate some. never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. Holy shit. <laughs> I haven't thought about that in a long time. That's something uh, Lee would say. Holy shit. I guess a deal's a deal. Here. That guy needs a drink more than any of us. I haven't to talk to Kenny. Time to not make it weird. Want to sit here? No, thanks. I'm fine. Oh, yeah, okay. Wherever you like. I'm going to talk to Kenny. Don't put the transform. Why can't I look at it? <coughs> this copy was a bad idea. Just I miss next. TV. Feels like forever since we had electricity. A little too bitter. Oh. See what Kenny does if I hand them the drink. <laughs> okay, he didn't. That kid's probably hungry, dude. Oh, that's not good. Nobody has All milk. Right, Clem. I asked you not to drink. Girl your age, it ain't right. I know you think you're older, but... Sorry about that. I didn't mean to disappoint you. You're not, huh? It's probably not my place to be telling you what to do. Just uh, needed some air. Kenny, there's air everywhere. I'm sorry for, for how I acted back there after Sarita was. I just. I, I couldn't handle it. I'm sorry. You did what you could. You tried to help, and I blamed you for it. Could have done more. No, don't say that. You did everything you could. I'm sorry if anything I said made you feel any different than that. It just makes me feel awful. I know I can be a real shit sometimes. Stop. No, it's true. But I. I 
miss my boy. I miss him so much. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there. Let's talk about that. A couple years. Okay. Off on a boat somewhere or other. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. Would I give anything for one more second with them? To play catch with Duck. To touch Conscious Face. I miss Duck too. He was a good friend. And I haven't had too many of them. He was a good boy, pure. Just wanted folks to be happy, that's all. A boy like that, thrown into a world like this. It's gonna be different with him. He's gonna get raised right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. You should get back over by the fire. Ain't no sense in both of us being over. I can handle watch on my own. You should come too. I don't know. Come on. It'll be good for everyone. Yeah, okay. I'm nervous about this guy. Oh, uh, I want to go see what he's... <laughs> oh, I guess not. Jane, you don't have to justify that with a response. Hey, I find it's best to just get this stuff out in the open. Less drama. Well, that's fine. But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. Shh, all right, enough of that. What? How you plan? It's nice to hear people laughing. Yeah, it is. And just spend so much time trying to stay alive that you don't get a chance to enjoy living. Yeah. We need to make more time for that. Alcohol helps. <laughs> Hell yeah, it does. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. Sounds like a waste of good rum. He lost his sister today. And whose fault was that? That makes it even harder to deal with. Trust me. He needs it as much as anyone right now. It's a nice thing to do. I said my piece. Amber alert in chat. Oh boy. Person. I just think good people do bad things sometimes. Do it a lot more nowadays with the world being what it is. So I think it's best. Leave to... me alone! Oh boy. Sorry, okay? My fault. I shouldn't have. Leave me alone! <clears throat> you stupid. It's okay. It's okay. She's in a better place. It's okay. It's okay. Maybe it's best if we all get some rest. Who knows how long we'll have to work tomorrow? Yeah, that's a good idea. <sighs> first watch. Thank you, Kenny. Really. Should the shouldn't the Kenny uh, the the baby be by the fire? Not in it or anything, but like. Warmer. Nice, not rested. Eh, whatever. That's just my thinking, you know. I have a feeling this guy's just leading us on a wild goose chase. You sure you're good? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. If I I start to crap out, I'll let you know. Okay, well, you do that. It's no trouble. How much further? Close. Very close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Come. I'm really starting to think <gasps> you're full of shit. It can't be much further. Behind you! What the fuck? Ah, ah, ah! Yeah! 
Jesus Christ. That was close. That fucker came out of nowhere. That was real loud. Hopefully there aren't more of them. Yeah, well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. It's very close. Come. Do this guy. I think he's a traitor. I'm not a traitor, but you know, he's leading us into a trap. Or a situation that's going to be a little difficult to get out of. This. That piece of shit? It's half built. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. Fireplace. Very warm. As long as there's food, who cares what it looks like? You're not going to think that when you wake up with a couple inches of snow covering you. Are we just going to walk over? Maybe there's a way around. I don't see any. Say it in an American asshole. <laughs> it's okay. Walk. Ice. No shit ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. I go first. I can be front. Maybe we shouldn't clump together. We just can't have too much weight. She's right. We need to spread out. Just to be safe. Less weight the better. Let the Rusky go first. Since he's so confident. It's okay. Oh boy, here we go. <sighs> I'm not hearing the warning signs I usually hear in real life. No, uh, splintering. So far, so good. But that's not good. We're okay. Don't worry. Oh, that's not good at all. We got some walkers behind us. That's only two of them. Should be all right. Let's just get to the house. Hey, stay with us. <laughs> Fuck. Keep moving, guys. Keep moving. It's too less to deal with. Just stay spread out and we'll be fine. Hey! Motherfucker! Shit! It's gonna kill him! Kenny! Get back here, you piece of shit! I should let you drown, you piece of shit! They made it. <coughs> oh no. Don't come over here. Hey, I can make it. It's it's fine. You sure? Yeah. You got walkers on the way. Let me help. It's too you. thin for both of us. I just I just gotta be careful. Oh, no, no! Jeez. Clam, you're gonna go. fall through. Go help no, Clam, Clam, do not. Just go back. I can. It's not. Um, I shouldn't be heavy. That I have enough to break the ice. Clam, look at me. <laughs> Pull out your gun and shoot those damn walkers, okay? Just give me a little time. Claim you can make it, but you need to go. Oh. Clementine, stop. Clementine! That was a dumb move, actually. Well, maybe. Are you serious? Well, that's good. Not good. <laughs> no, Luke! No! 
died or at least it looked like he died I should have just covered him I, I was that wasn't a very good move look at that he don't give a shit he's fucking angry give me that dirty look Another just like it. He wasn't lying. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is going to help? How is beating a kid to death going to help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know. Let me get a fire started. You okay? He's hurt real bad. Mike! Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh... Oh boy. Okay. Ooh, he's just staring daggers at Clementine. I thought I had matches. Hey, you got that, uh, nail fire. Gator Tough. Oh, yeah. I feel bad. Luke's dead. Or at least I think he's dead. Let me take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Kenny's out back trying to get some stupid truck started. Oh, well, if you get that truck started. We should eat something. <clears throat> you okay? He's gone. I've lost people before, but it just hasn't felt this this shitty in a while. He was a great guy. God damn it. 
Everybody died. I'm glad you did. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. I can't take this shit anymore. Oh man, everybody's breaking now that what's his name died. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth the crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up. Be out of here by nightfall. Just give me a minute. I'll wait for you out back. <coughs> I'll watch him. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Benny. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, alright? Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. Always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean some bitch, but he taught me respect. A girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. We're all just tired. Hell, I've been tired for two years. All right, give it a turn. So close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running, and then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's got to be out there. Now, those rumors can't all be bunk. What about there Mexico? Be something out here, other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. Sounds good to me. We're gonna make it, Clem. I know it. Turn it again. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it. <sighs> we'll get it working. We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. It is. We gotta get this thing to start. Gonna He's try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. Hey, what about the evacuator? Not quite a car, but it'll get us across the freaking. Wish they'd finish this place. Want one? <laughs> no thanks. 
They know the fucking cigarettes, Clem. It's not like drinking. Do you remember when you saw me first? Back at the lodge? Check her for weapons. <laughs> I liked you from the start. You ever done something you regret? Even if it's something you knew you had to do. <laughs> All the time. Yeah. Very somber episode. Oh. You know, I'll say one thing about Lou. <clears throat> no matter where you end up, there's always one bad seed rocking the boat. But I don't think he would have ever been that guy. Let me ask you something, Clem. When's the last time anyone did what you wanted? I think people respect me. Really? <laughs> I think so. Well, good for you, honey. You know, I've been all over. Run with a lot of people. A lot of men. And listen to a lot of promises. Ain't one of them come true. I'm starting to think there might be another way, you know? I'm gonna go take a piss. I have a bad feeling she's not coming back. I don't know. Everybody seems like they're breaking up now. Don't wanna... Deal. Hey. Mike and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved them in here. Seen that look before. Son of a bitch. Oh, shit. I've seen it too. A few times. Then you know what's about to happen. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy too. Once. Probably had a nice job, a nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Oh, yeah. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two's known each other a long time. Sooner or later, we're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. I think it needs food or something. Oh, poor damn freaking kid. He needs sustenance. He needs milk. Seems like you've done that before. You want to try? No way. It's going to puke. Clem, no. Hold it like this. Hey, hi. <laughs> My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. <coughs> it puked. It puked. <laughs> There's not much left. I was running with some people a long time ago down near DC. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out. All that for one person? That's what I'm saying. Didn't find out till later he was already bit. 
turn and rip the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky, like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. You got it working. But I tell you. So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? Not much. We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, someplace warm. I agree. We should head down south. What? We're kind of freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? What the fuck? It was just an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. We're not going back. I'm with Kenny. We should head north. Goddamn right. Clem, my friend Krista. She told me about Wellington a long time ago, Jade. It's out there. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. What about Arvo? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. He could die. We have to bring him with us. I'm not gonna let him die. That's fucked up. He can help us. Oh yeah, somehow he's <sighs> he got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation, but maybe if you eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You gonna think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. God damn it! Kenny, are you okay? Oh, crap. I have a bad feeling about this, this situation. Uh, everybody's imploding. This whole situation's imploding. You better talk some sense into him. For his sake. Hello, welcome to my room, viewers. Oh, you doing? Close the door. Can you believe this, Clem? I bring them a working truck, and they act like I just shit in their cereal. I knew Jane had had a stick up her ass, but I thought at least Mike had have more sense. He's turned out to be a real disappointment. Well, why can't we just leave tomorrow? Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. Oh, crap. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia <sighs> looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. I know. You're right. Someone's got to keep this group together. That kid's depending on us. <sighs> I wish Lee was here. They had a way of bringing people together. I think he'd tell me to try to keep the group together and that we should keep moving. I think you're right. Shit, she remembered the last thing I told her. We can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew and what people like Jane won't ever understand. 
I know Wellington might be bullshit, but where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dead. <clears throat> and when you sat down next to me and we shared that meal, well, I could tell that you were different now, grown up. But I felt pride, a pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. It's the only chance that child has. Yeah, but we can't do it alone. We need the others. And that's why I gotta be able to count on you, Clem. We gotta convince them. You and me. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Come on. Let's get some sleep. Don't leave the keys in there. I don't trust them. Oh, I might run off with the car. Probably gonna be really bad. I don't know. I'm nervous about is what happens if Alvo gets gets loose and steals the freaking car. That noise, bad thing. Oh, you son of a bitch. Clown. Shit. What are you doing? I got the rest of it. Clem. What'd you ask them to do? Now keep it down, all right? Nobody else has to get involved. That's everything we have. Listen, you just gotta get away from that guy, Clem. Okay? Who? Kenny? Damn it, just we don't have time for this. Just just Oh, this is a bad situation. Oh shit! No. Think you did the right thing? Oh, we got it. Feels a flashback to the first season. Lee? It's just a bad dream, sweet pea. Yeah, maybe she's talking to Lee in the afterlife. What was it about? Duck? works yet. Maybe it's like a cold. His mom's a doctor. Maybe she can help him. He's going to die. I know it. You don't know that? I feel bad. Why? If 
called him a crybaby when I hid the bug in his pillow. <laughs> oh, that's okay, honey. He didn't mean it. Lee? Hmm? Why did Lily do that to Carly? I don't know. She was sad, Clem. That can make people angry sometimes. Because of her dad? Yeah. Clem, people don't always make sense. How come? Because bad things happen to everyone. And it's hard to keep being yourself after they do. Do you think we should have let Lily stay? I don't know. <sighs> I don't either. But I don't know if we did the right thing. How can you tell? Well, it's not like math, Claire. Sometimes there just isn't the right answer. There's no absolutes when it comes to that. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, sweet pea. And a part of growing up is doing what's best for the people you care about. Even if sometimes hurting someone else I don't want to hurt anyone it's not that easy I'm scared Lee what can I tell you to make it better <laughs> that it'll be okay it will it's gonna get better Clem You'll make it better. Everything's gonna be all right. <laughs> now let's try to get some sleep. Okay, Lee. Oh man. He's having a, a relapse in the memory relapse right now. On the left! Slow down! Shut up! She's awake. Oh damn, she le he left the others, I guess. Hey you. Clem! Oh, thank God! You passed out from the shock. What happened? That piece of shit Rusky shot you. We had to run the truck to keep you warm. How do you feel? It hurts. Couldn't find the bullet. Must have gone clean through. It'll burn a while, but... Those sons of bitches. I mean, I expected it from the Russian. But Mike? Yeah. I could tell they were working on something. I didn't think they'd go that far. Is Bonnie okay? They took off on foot. Didn't get this puppy thanks to you. Now that Clem's awake, we should talk about where we're going. We're headed north. What, to find Wellington? You sure talk a lot of shit. But you got a better plan? We head south. Back to house. Carver's camp? What the fuck kind of plan is that? I think Bonnie said there was more formula back there. And we actually know where it is. I don't care where we go. Just please, stop arguing. She's the one that's going off. Because you won't listen to a thing I'm saying. What's that? You're talking into my bad ears, sweetheart. Jackass. Oh, I still can't hear you. Look, even if there is some place up here, it could take us weeks to find it. We could get back to Howe's in a day. Tell you what, we can turn around just as soon as you pry this wheel from my cold, dead fingers. How's that sound? Whatever. I give up. Get your feet off the dash. Let's play a game, Clem. I spy with my little eye an asshole. 
Your turn. Grow up. Go to hell. I'll pull this fucking car over. Go ahead. You want to die out here? You're both being children. Me? I couldn't see the damn road. Bet you're having trouble seeing a lot of things these days. You shut your fucking mouth. I am done playing games with you, Jay. Fuck you. You don't know a damn thing oh, about Oh, god damn it. Oh, I know exactly what you are. Nothing. Nobody cares about you. And you don't care about nobody but yourself. That makes you nothing. What is it with you? It's your family, right? Don't. It is, isn't it? Oh no. I'm warning you, you little shit. You're just another type A asshole trying to save a bunch of dead people. Watch the road. I am, goddammit. You listen to me. You mouth off about my family, and I will fucking end you. Jesus Christ, I am so sick of this wounded warrior crap. Just pull over. I can't take this. What? Running away again? What a fucking shocker. In the end, still only care about yourself, right? And where were you when Serena oh, this got is about... Kenny? Huh? It's about to where end badly. You? I was there. I couldn't... God damn you, I love that woman! Nobody who died is anyone's fault. We we all wanted to be together, and it just went bad. But we owe it to them to try to make the best of this. I'm sorry, Clem, but I can't put up with this bullshit anymore. Oh. The feeling's mutual. You know the thing about people like you, Kenny? You're just a bomb waiting to go off. Everyone talks about you behind your back because they're afraid of you. That ain't Mike, true. Mike, Bonnie, Sarita. Fucking liar, that ain't true. Everyone around you knows that sooner or later, they're gonna end up dead. Sarita knew it, I know it, and so does Clementine. I told you not to talk about my family. Fuck you. You fucking piece of shit. Go to hell, you son of a bitch. Jesus. You okay? I'm fine. How's AJ? He's fine. You sure? Yes. Clem, you all right? Yeah. Kenny, I'm... Wait, hold on. Go around. One of them might have diesel. We shouldn't stop here. We're running on fumes. Got no choice. When I holler, it's okay. Drive up closer. Anything happens. I'll try to meet you there. All right? If you're going, go now. Kenny. That fucking asshole. God. I can't do this anymore. I'm serious, Clem. I tried, but I just can't. You're both losing it. Clem, everyone's like that around here. You know that. Clem, we could leave right now. Are you serious? What about AJ? Look, I, I know you're close to him, but Kenny would never let him go. This is our chance, Clem. I have a bad feeling this is not the last you know episode. Like to live your own life? It's snowing. Why are they moving? They must not be cold enough yet. Drive. See that pedal on the floor? Step on it. Don't just sit there. What are you doing? Hurry up. Jesus. What happened to your damn freaking screwdriver weapon? Jane! Well, I don't know what happened to Kenny.
Darn it, it's too damn hard to see anything. I'm just going this way, I don't have no idea what the hell where the hell I'm going. No clue where I'm going, I'm just fucking going straight. <laughs> oh, this isn't good. Hey, wait, there's something here, sidewalk, some kind. There's a rest stop. Where's the kid? You okay? Where's the kid? Jane, where is he? What did you do? Eves? What are you saying? No. No! No, not again. What are you doing? What? what kind of shit are you trying to pull? You're gonna see what he really is. Don't tell me you're trying to use yourself as an example. Try to stop this before it gets really nasty.
Oh shit. Fuck it. Kenny went too far there. What's up, dude? Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. And he was going crazy. Fuck that guy. Clam. You made the right choice. I let you down. <coughs> I let everyone down. <laughs> Why did you make me do this? I'm sorry. I don't if Oh sorry to hood. Oh what? Jane you Understand if you're upset. AJ was never in any danger. I was just going to try to talk you into coming with me. I just thought if you saw Kenny like that, you'd know we'd have to leave him. Look, Clem, I'm sorry. Oh. I didn't think Kenny would go that far. Seth, you're fucking crazy. How could you do this? I had to do it, Clem. You saw how he reacted. I had to show you what he was capable of. So you put AJ in danger and got my friend killed just to prove a point? It was a stupid thing. I should never have lied to you. But I thought it was the only way you'd see me. Oh my god. Kenny, you have to forgive me. Please. We can just leave all this behind us. Please. I did it for you, Clem. Oh, she's a crazy bitch. Fuck this shit. We're free now. I'm not going anywhere with you. Clem, please. I did this for you. I can't do this alone. Okay? Is that what you want to hear? Fuck that. Crazy bitch. Clem? I did not expect that. Hmm. I thought, seriously, the kid died. <laughs> Nine days later. Maybe that means that Clem actually survived. Alright, alright. Well, I couldn't stay with Jane. Crazy bitch.
Hey, where did I get the hatchet? Oh, she's doing the freaking walker thing. Yeah, that's what pisses me off. She didn't say anything about it. Or else I wouldn't have never have killed Kenny. But considering the injuries Kenny was sustaining, I don't think he would have lived. I don't know. Maybe. Or maybe you would just die slowly. Damn, that's hardcore. Yeah. Fucking Clementine. Yeah, I killed Kenny. <laughs> oh shit, I just got the reference. <laughs> I'm a bastard. Oh well. <laughs> All right. I thought they didn't pop up. Why? Oh well. That was weird. There's usually they pop immediately. Hmm. What time is it right now? San Diego. Let's see here. Past two. Oh well. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, dude. There's a lot of endings for this season. There's a lot of things you could have done in the middle of the game that could have changed things, too. Probably. I'm sure there's probably an ending where Clem would probably be alone at the end of the game. In the sense of, like, all throughout the first, last episode. Just getting a lot of vibes from that. Especially for what uh, things you could have done in the middle of the game. If you want, I don't mind if you spoil it. I might not play this for a couple years anyway. I usually play games every few years. <laughs> Probably was. All these episodes were approximately anywhere between an hour and 30 minutes to an hour and 45 minutes long. They actually did a good job with pacing. Oh, nope, that's it for tonight, looks like. Got an early day tomorrow. Probably flip a coin whether or not I'm gonna play uh, the next uh, season or go with another game. I'm not sure yet. I'll sleep on it and find out. Most likely, I probably will uh, flip a coin, probably, knowing me. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. It's a pleasure. You guys take care. I'll see you next time. All right. Have a good day, night. Awesome. See you later. Pleasure, dude. Alright, take care, Chris.